I am. Yes, I am Madame Saint Germain. It is an honor to be here for this Dreamwalker School. Death. Death is a word that humans don't like to hear, they don't like to talk about. It brings up issues, and it brings up fear, and it brings up controversy, it brings up religion. This fear of death is is the greatest fear that any human has. Because of this thing called the veil, or the doorway, you for have forgotten what death was about. Imagine not having the worry of death, not thinking about the finality of life, but rather the evolution of beingness. Imagine not thinking you're going to die when you're 60 or 80 years old, not worrying about what happens when you cross over to the other side. Imagine how much more you could actually enjoy your life right now if you were able to totally let go of that fear of death. Death is a beautiful thing because it allows the completion of a cycle, the completion of a story. Death returns you to a more natural state of being. The Dreamwalker is the guide who helps take these ones who are dying over to the other side. The Dreamwalker is a friend, but a friend who listens, a friend who doesn't talk about any particular spiritual or religious philosophy or about belief systems. The Dreamwalker is not trying to change anything for the one who is dying. They're not trying to make them believe a certain thing. They are simply accompanying them. You are guides without agenda. Guides who go on a loving and beautiful and very sacred walk with those who are departing. You help them while they were on earth, in their physical body, letting go of the pain, letting go of the suffering. At the Bridge of Flowers, you let them go. You let them walk across the bridge. The bridge that is the final transitioning of this whole experience of death. And on the other side of the Bridge of Flowers, they are met by those who are their true and real family, angels of the highest order. It was practiced extensively back in the times of Atlantis. It was practiced extensively in old Egypt. That is where it truly became an art. And word of this thing called dreamwalking spread across other lands to other peoples all over the world. The indigenous ones in America, Africa, Australia have all practiced this thing called dreamwalking in one form or the other. You have an understanding of the whole cycle that takes place from death to rebirth and to change within the physical body, the rebirthing of spirit embodied in matter. You'll understand what happens, why you come to earth in the first place. You'll understand the cycle of what happens when you leave earth. You'll take down this fear, this huge barrier that you have about death. That will go away. And death will become just another experience. You won't try to hang on to the physical being. You'll appreciate having it. You'll appreciate everything in your life. 